Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamu alaikum. I hope you all are fine and staying safe and happy. I am your GK teacher, Ms. Fahir, and I welcome you all to your GK class. My dear students, as you know that we are on unit number 17 and the name of our unit is Growth and Development in Animals. So my dear students, we are learning about the natural language in the world. We are learning about them. In today's lecture, we will learn about animals and their young ones. یعنی کہ جانور اور ان کے بچوں کے بارے پڑھیں گے اور ان کے بچوں کے جو مختلف نام ہے بچے ان کو بھی سیکھ پائیں گے So my dear students, let's start the lecture with, an act, uh, with a recap So what changes occur in human from childhood to adulthood یعنی کہ جیسے جیسے انسان میں growth کا process ہوتا ہے تو وقت کے ساتھ ساتھ یعنی کہ بچے سے بڑے ہونے تک ان میں کون کون سے changes آتے ہیں They grow in height, they become more strong, they become more independent So these are different changes that we uh, observe when human beings grow from childhood to adulthood. So my dear students, now is the time for an activity. So look at these pictures. This is a very cute baby cat. And this is, what is this? Insect? No, it is a caterpillar. Okay? Caterpillar ka sab ko pata hai na? It is a baby butterfly. So, do you know the name of baby cat? Do you know the name of the baby butterfly? So, kya aapko pata hai ki ek jo cat ka chota sa baby hota hai, usko kya kehte hai? It is called a kitten. Yani ki billi ke bacho ka ek specific naam hota hai, jab wo babies hota hai, unko hum kehte hai kitten. Aur isi tarikye se jo butterfly ke babies hota hai, when they come out of the egg, to uski jo first stage hoti hai, usko hum kehte hai caterpillar. Kya kehte hai? Caterpillar कहते हैं। So इसी तरीके से तम मुख्तलिफ जानवरों के बच्चों के मुख्तलिफ नाम होते हैं जब वो अपने initial baby stage में होते हैं। So now is the time for pre-reading question. So do all animals have their young ones? Yes. And what are the names of animals' young ones? So जानवरों के बच्चों के मुख्तलिफ नाम होते हैं, जैसे कि बिल्ली के बच्चे का नाम kitten है, इसी तरह butterfly के बच्चे का नाम caterpillar है। तो इसी तरीके से अभी हम घोड़े के और मुख्तलिफ जानवरों के बच्चों के नाम जो है वो सीखेंगे। So my dear students, let's start the reading. I request you all to please open page number 143 in your GK2 books. I hope everybody has opened the page. So now let's start the reading. Put your fingers where I will read. Animals and their young ones. Young ones of some animals have special name, names as well. Baby swans are called pigeons. Tigeons, यानी कि जो baby swan होती है, हंस राज जो होता है, उर्दू में इसको हंस राज भी कहते हैं, उसके बच्चों को tigeons कहते हैं। इसके अलावा जो horse होता है, उसके baby का नाम होता है Paul, Paul। Cat के बच्चों का नाम होता है Kitten, Frog के baby का नाम होता है Tadpole, this is a baby tad, baby frog and it is called a tad. Butterfly के baby का नाम होता है caterpillar. Dog के बच्चों को हम puppies कहते हैं. तो आप देखें हर जानवर के बच्चों के मुख्तलिफ names हैं. So, print out the line sketches of some animals and their young ones with the help of any of your elder. Color these animals and label their names. So, my dear students, आपने अब अपने घर में किसी बड़े की मदद से आपने क्या करना है कि आपने स्केचेस निकालने हैं टीचर की क्लास में भी एक्टिविटी करवा सकती है किसी भी एनिमल का और उसके बच्चे का और बच्चे जो है वो लाइंस को ज्वाइन करके और उसके बाद उसको कलर करेंगे सो बच्चे जो है हाइट में और साइज में भी डिफरेंशिएट कर सकते हैं एंड देन दे आल्सो हैव टू गेस कि ये कौन सा एनिमल है सो फॉर अवेल्युएशन क्विकली आंसर द क्वेश्चंस व्हाट डज द यंग वन ऑफ हॉर्स कॉल इट इज कॉल्ड अ फॉल व्हाट इज अ साइजेंट इट इज अ बेबी स्वान व्हाट आर द यंग कैट्स कॉल्ड किटन्स what is a puppy? It is a baby dog. What are the parents of tadpole and caterpillar? The uh, tadpole parents are frog, whereas caterpillar parents are butterfly. So my dear students, now let's quickly move forward towards the practice for which you need to download this worksheet from the description box below this video or you can get it in print form by a teacher. So you have to match the column, match the parent animal to their young ones. So, Paul, frog, you will write here horse because this is a fall. 
then you will write here butterfly sergeant okay and this is how you will complete it so this is your worksheet assessment sheet write down your name and the roll number label the pictures of young ones so this is a caterpillar this is the tadpole this is a fall and these are sergeants this is a kitten so you will pause the video and you will complete the worksheet and this is a puppy i hope everybody has done it so my dear students quickly note down your homework now for homework you will do mcq number 4 and 5 given on page number 142 48 you will also do Section D given on page number one hundred and forty-nine. You will do it in your books. You will do question number four given on page number one hundred and forty-nine. Also do independent activity number two given on page number one hundred and forty-five. So, my dear students, these are the two MCQs that you have to do, and this is the match the column that you have to do in your books. So, my dear students, the wrap up of the lesson is today we have learned that all animals have their live ones, young ones, and they have different names. Um, तो उन वो नेम्स जो है हमने आज सीखे हैं आई होप यू हैव एंजॉयड द लेक्चर कीप एवरीबडी अराउंड यू सेफ हैव अ गुड डे थैंक यू सो मच अनला